here now. And I said, yeah, I was thinking about it. I was going to get something to eat or whatever. Right? Oh, that's, I'm, I'm really happy you're going to stay here, right? Well, you are, you should tell. I think that's somebody to talk to. Jesus, he hit, she hit the jackpot, I saw. Yes, boy, what? I said, oh my God. I said, yes, boy. That's one of the things. Tell me a story. And she said, what? I said, tell me a story. Peace. And she said, tell you a story. And I said, like, there's a fucking echo in there. Well, I got to see what Stephen said to me. So I, uh, I said, yes, that's how people get talking, you know, like they tell stories, you know, and everything. I'd like to hear a story about you. So she said, well, hold my hand. And I said, hold your hand. Yes, she said, that's a what? She said, this is a really sad story. I said, holy fuck, her mother's out there dying now, her dog ran away, you know, somebody backed over her cat. Jesus Christ, so look at what I'm to now. I said, okay, give me your hand. She was looking at me. She said, you sure wants to hear that? I said, oh yeah, 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 go ahead, go ahead, but, you know, I'll, I'll help you through this. Right now. Counselor Gord. She said, did you see him two girls was there behind me? When you came in, I said, no, I uh, must say I didn't notice them, you know. I said, generally I only notice the pretty girls and you oh, were the one that caught my eye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. That's all I can say. And uh, I, I said, Have I got? So, uh, where them, uh, where them girls now? Oh, they're gone now. They got the table, right? She said, They came in and they looked around, and the waitress came over and said, Do you want a table? And they said, Yes, we want a table. And she said, Well, it'll be 10 or 15 minutes. So I said, Okay. And so I looked at them and I said, there are two girls, there are two nurses I trained. She said, I did their certification, blah, 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 this and everything else like that. So I said, well, you can sit down here with me. You want to even sit there, you want to even sit there. And they said, no, we'd rather stand. She said, they wouldn't even sit down with me. They wouldn't talk to me, wouldn't sit down with me. Well, my God, that's awful. I cannot understand how anybody would not want to talk to you. Here you are, a wonderful looking person, you know, he talks right now, he talks kind of funny, childishly. <coughs> and, uh, I said, you're a really uh, pretty looking lady, girl, you know. Oh, I said, you got nice hair, and I thought was, I said, you got, you got really good eyes, you know, and you got uh, nice lips, and you got pretty good teeth. Well, you could use a bit of dental work on the left side. <laughs> He's only putting a few things in there. Oh, Mr. God, I said that before I realized. I said, they're really weak looking, though, you know. You know, obviously you take good care of them or whatever, right, you know. Fuck you, did you look at her twat? <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, well, there goes my hopes for putting this story on YouTube. <laughs> don't put that on YouTube, please don't. No, sir, That's my own personal memories now. No. Mom ruined it with the twat. She was telling me about being married and her husband. And she asked me where I was from. I said, uh, Labrador. And she said, her husband was from Labrador. I said, where to? And she said, who's saying that? Well, I used to live in Goose Bay, but I said, I uh, live in Labrador City now. My mother was only, I said, I got a daughter down here. You uh, don't see my little honey. Honey, you you don't know if he says that. He says he calls you that when you're not around. I, I said my daughter took off to Toronto, so I'm all alone. She said I got the jackpot now. And, uh, so uh, anyway, she was telling me about her mother-in-law and off some more stuff on the house. Then the fellow come in, he said, oh geez, I lost my shoe. 
She what? said, that's my husband. He was at the liquor store and he lost his shoe. And I said, oh my God, here I am holding her hand. Now her husband is there, right? This is going to be a decent record. And what did you do? I'm trying to get away. And she's holding on to me. And she said, honey, this guy used to live in Goose Bay or whatever, right? And I said, what's your name? And he told me his name and, and whatever. And we started talking to him. So I'm still holding on. So I said, okay. So then we was all three of us talking a bit. So then my food came, so then I was able to get my head away and eat or whatever. So in, when did Stephen come in, and was he there when Stephen come? Yeah, yeah, he was there, and Stephen come in, the first the girl come in. They called. And then like, what are you doing? And I said, I uh, just came in here and getting something to eat, who's this, who's here, or whatever, right? I don't know why I didn't see anybody, or whatever, right? So Stephen and I know I don't think so, why, you know. And then Stephen came in. Holy shit, Batman, right? So you see him on the phone right away. You get a picture since, so did he? No, no picture. Um, yeah. So then my food came, and I got my food scrambled out, and I said, I gotta go now, I gotta go. So I did that. 